Welcome back everyone. You may be trying to fix some audio delay issues you may be having on your Android. That's a very easy thing to do and it doesn't really take too much time. So what you want to do is make sure that the audio device that you're using, so your Bluetooth you know, device or whatever, you want to go ahead and make sure that it's fully connected to your specific device. So in this case, let's say it was a pair of AirPods or something. Well, you want to make sure they're connected. So make sure you go you make your way to your Bluetooth settings here. You want to click on network and internet or whatever. You want to go and click on connected devices and you want to make sure that the AirPods that you have are fully connected or the headphones or whatever Bluetooth device that you have, that they're fully connected here. Now, the next thing you have to remember is that occasionally, sometimes a device that you have may be very outdated and it may not be using the most recent version of you know, the drivers for your Bluetooth device. So if you have a very outdated speaker or headphones, it doesn't really matter what you do. You can't really you know stop that latency between them. Another big thing you can do is bring your speaker closer to your specific Android. So if your speakers or headphones are super far away, well, you're probably going to have a problem. So you want to go ahead and make sure they're close, and that can reduce some latency within your device as well. Another big thing you can do is update that application that you're using. So if you're streaming a video from YouTube or if you're listening to you know, Spotify or something, well, you may want to go ahead and search for Spotify or Out Music or whatever it is. You want to go ahead and search for those and you want to go ahead and update those specific applications. So if it's YouTube that you're watching, you may want to go ahead and make sure you know you can download the latest update and see if that fixed it as well. Another big thing you can do is restart your phone. So go and hold on the power button, restart your device and see if that works. Another big thing you can do is to update your Android phone. If it's very outdated, you may have some issues there too. So go and find your system settings. You want to click on system update and you want to go ahead and update your specific Android to the most recent version of software that's available. So those are just a couple different ways to fix it. If you guys have any other questions or anything like that, let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, that would mean so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out till then.